the county has been trying to address crime in downtown Silver Spring. Now police say some efforts, like the drone program, have been helpful, but some crimes still persist. The third district accounted for 23 percent of all crimes in the county. Um, more specifically, in this sector is known as the George sector in downtown Silver Spring. This area accounted for 9 percent of the crimes in all of the county. When um, we get a 911 call, we can either put the address in the, in the toolbar Chief Jones said the police department's drone program has responded to more than 450 calls in the short time it's been in place. That in 53 of those particular incidents, we didn't need to deploy an officer because the drone was able to get there. We saw on video uh, there was no need for police service and therefore allowed officers to be uh, not tied up on a call for unnecessary reasons. And what we want to do is be able to deter crime and solve crime by creating a kind of infrastructure that if you come into Silver Spring and you think you're going to commit a crime, you're going to be aware that you're under camera surveillance, that we've got drones that can respond quickly, and so people think twice about doing something here. When we talk about crime too, when we, and, and as the county executive noted, about our violent crimes in some cases going down, such as carjackings where we're not having the numbers that we've had in the past, we again are working towards making that trend to continuously go down. The one crime that I know that is going up tremendously and has been going up the last couple of years have been auto theft. Um, auto thefts are really at an all time high. Silver Spring is a place where we want to make sure people feel and are safe and can thrive. In downtown Silver Spring, Mariam Shazad for MCM.